Hi guys, I wanted to come to you today with my candle empties and I have a visitor here. I guess he's wanting to be in videos more often now, so this is Charlie. He's a sweetie. He's kicking the candle bucket. <laughs> yeah, he thinks I'm an idiot, so <laughs> he's probably had it with me today. I keep picking him up and petting him and everything, so you all like to see him, so I thought I would show you all Charlie. So, and if you all have been around here during the winter, Pink Cat sent me a squirrel in, I showed um, a friend mail, and so I got the squirrel right here, and a the little cup that she sent to me. I absolutely love it. So, I found that I could put him down here. I was seeing in my video, I was watching my video, and I saw something laying there in the back of it. I'm like, what is that? So, I had to get up and come in. It was a little individual pack of almonds. It was like I had already eaten them all and I stuck the wrapper right there. I don't know how that happened. I don't know if I picked it up out of the floor and put it there or I finished eating them and put it there. But in one of my, some of my videos, apparently I shot with an empty package there. So go figure. You never know what's going to happen in my videos. This month I um, did melt some of my Yankee candles. I melted them in my crock and that's my candle crock or my candle jar crock that's in there and I melted one of my Yankee candle white chocolate apples. Here's one of them and this is what it looks like after it is way down there. I can't that's it's probably right there where the center of it goes in, if you can see that. So, I can still smell a little bit of it in there. I couldn't smell anything the other day, and I was like, when I let it um, get um, solid, and I thought, okay, well, we're done, because it was in there like three or four days. I have another one in there going that I started last night, so... Um, I wanted to make sure that I'm going through these and getting the scent out of them. I may have to put this one back in the crock when the other one goes, but um, I may let it go. During Easter, I did this one, and this one is the jelly beans, and I did it for that weekend. And as you can see, this one caved in too. It's way down there. So I can smell a little bit out of it, but I couldn't smell it when it was even warming in there. So I just took it off the warmer and let it go because if it's not going to give me any scent I don't really care but the white chocolate apple does throw and um, that's why I have another one in there I want to try to get rid of some of those large jars out of my collection so those are the only candles that I have I went through uh, bunny sisters coconut milk and lavender and this was really good I think this was two of the roses and I've cut them up and absolutely love them had them melting in my bedroom to sleep and they are amazing so and you know bunny sisters is one of my favorite um places to order from i finish up a sensationals pumpkin apple muff muffins i am not sure why but i was just in the mood to melt this it is not fall it is spring around here it has been kind of rainy and cool some days so that's why i got this out but I absolutely love the smell of this. It's amazing. So I got it out and I melted it. I have a lot to melt around here. And speaking of that, um, I also have went through two of the white chocolate um, tarts as well. So I went through those. I went through a Sensible Magic Crazy Blonde. Um, one of my subbies sent me this. I cannot remember. I have two of them. Uh, Katie Love was one that sent it, and another person. I took the address off the box so I wouldn't show it, and of course I took the card out of the box, so I don't know exactly who sent this to me, but whoever did, thank you very much. I loved it. I This one was amazing. Um, I can still smell it in here. It is fruity, and it is amazing. It's kind of like a Kool-Aid type smell. Oh my God, I love those smells so good. I also went through one of the Sensible Magic Pina Coladas. This was good as well. 
I love this. I love pina colada smells. It was good. I think out of the two, though, I think I like the Crazy Blonde the best. Um, this one was good, the pina colada, but I think I like the Crazy Blonde better. Um, it's got raspberry and cranberry with street... Added sweet strawberry straight from the garden. Ice champagne. So, I like this one the best. Um, but I do love my pina colada scents. Do not get me wrong on that. I do love them. This one, I stuck these two in there together just to get rid of them. Um, I couldn't really smell them and I did not want a Christmas scent in my house. Um, it's I put the Alpine Cheer and the Cleopatra together and I mixed them and they were fine. Um, I could smell them. It wasn't any off-the-wall funky kind of deal, but it smelled good and... Hey, I got rid of two of those little things. I also went through a Sensationals Unicorn Cake Uniquely Sweet. And I love this. It, it just smells good. And I have several backups of these. So I am good to go with that. Um, I think it was Katie Love. She sent this to me. One of my subbies again sent this to me. And I've got it all discombobulated but this was cutie pie from rainbow melts um i like this this smelled really good there was two little uh, flowers in it and i absolutely loved them and it's cream cheese frosting strawberries and buttercream pie so you know that has to smell good if you like any type of food scent so that was an amazing one and i went through another one of my sassy girl aroma sweet teas I love this. This is one of the things that keeps me calm and I need to be calm and relaxed with this pinched nerve that I have. And since I can't diamond paint and all I can do is watch TV or sleep, I'm not happy about that, but all right. And then I finished up my last bag of root beer float from Sassy Girl Aroma and I am so sad because I absolutely love this. And it is uh, root beer and vanilla ice cream. It is Oh my god, it smelled so amazing. You could just smell the root beer. Oh, and I love root beer. Oh, that smells amazing. So I'm sad to see that go, but I didn't want anything to go to waste. And then the last thing I have in here is Kay's Creation Fluffy Lavender Cake. And I really liked this one as well. I had that one in my bedroom, so that one was good. So that is all of the wax seems to empties that I have for April 2019. Um, I have some melts. These take a while to get through these sassy girl aromas. Um, the cutie pie, there was two in there. That wasn't long. And these two um, I love from Sensationals. Easy to go through. And I wanted to get out, get these out. And now that it's spring, I wanted to get these out because these are the right time to have these sensible magic ones. And then I just wanted to get through with these because these were just around, floating around, falling all over the place. And then I wanted to get through some of my candles. And when I'm here on the weekends, I'm going to start um, melting my candles like this and getting them out of here because um, I just want to get things out of my life. And um, those are some of them. So you will see another one of these again next month because there's one in there um, going right now. And stay tuned to see what nonsense I get involved in next time. I still have a ton of um, wax candles to go through around here. Um, I'm trying to use them as fast as I can, but it, there's only so much you can do. Uh, melt at one time, otherwise it'll throw you in the backyard. So um, I'm trying. I haven't gotten any new stuff since, well, Pink Cat sent me some Tahitian Woods in a friend mail and then the spring ones are the last ones that I got from Walmart so I have not been spending money on any wax lately so I just want to use up what I got um, I'm doing that with a lot of things in my life like my beauty stuff um, I have got some stuff from the Sephora VIB Sephora VIB sale but Actually, I went and I wandered around Sephora for an hour and a half or longer today, and I come out of the store with nothing. So, um, I don't need a lot of stuff. There are some things that I'm going to get that I need, but 
I'm just not in that mode of purchasing stuff just to be purchasing things. So, um, if there is a scent that you want me to find that you think I would enjoy and you want to know what my um, thoughts are on it, let me know. I would be glad to go out and get that scent and see, you know, what I think of it. Um, I will melt it. I'm not going to burn anything um, because that's gone awry several times in my house with me trying to burn things in this house. So, um, let me know. Um, I would love to do something. I want to try to do some different things on my channel and um, I want to do more candle related stuff or wax related stuff I should say because I'm not burning candles but um, let me know if there's something you want me to do and I'm going to do a video on tea so if you like that let me know about that. Um, I'm just trying to do some new things here um, let you know what I'm enjoying right now and um, so if you like the video please give it a thumbs up if you'd like to subscribe please do i would love to have you here and i will see you guys in my next video have a good day bye